Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. We are going to solve if an AP is given 9, 17, 25 and we have to solve how many terms must be taken to give a sum of 636. So let's find out. So in AP, the first term is A that is 9 and D is the difference between first two terms. So 17 minus 9 is 8. We will check the difference is equal or not with the subtraction of third and second terms. Yes, so D is 8. Now what is given? The sum SN is 636. So we have to find how many terms. How many terms means we have to find the N. So we will use the formula of SN that is N by 2, 2A plus N minus 1 times D. So SN is 636 and we have to find A is 9 and N we have to find D is 8. So 636 is equals to N by 2 here 18 plus 8N minus 8. So 613 is equals to N by 2. This is 10 plus 8N. Now from the bracket, if I will take 2 as common, so it will become 5 plus 4n, it will cancel out. So 636 is equals to 5n plus 4n square, which I can write it as 4n square plus 5n minus 636 is equals to 0. Now I can write this 5n as 53n minus 12n. Sorry, 48. Now from first two term, we cannot take common. So we will write the equation as Now, if I'll take 4n as common, so n minus 12. And now if I'll take 53 as common, n minus 12 is equals to 0. Now, 4n plus 53 and n minus 12 is equals to 0. Put that equals to 0. So, n is equals to minus 53 by 4. And here, n is equals to 12. So, number of terms cannot be in negative or in irrational form. So, n is equals to 12. So, there will be 12 terms that gives a sum 636 when the AP is 9, 17 and 25. I hope it's clear and you find it useful. So, don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and keep learning with confidence.